Hey, how you doing today? I am Tequila Coleman. In today's video, I'm going to share a dream God gave me this morning at six o'clock this morning. So in the dream, um, I was in a vehicle. I was in um, a silver Malibu. I do believe that this was this is the same vehicle I had back in 2007. Um, my dad at that time, he had bought me um, a brand new uh, 2000 and I think it was, uh, it could have been 2007 uh, Malibu. And so that was the vehicle I was sitting in, in the dream. And there were two guys from my past who um, was trying to get in the vehicle. They were trying to get in like the back seat. Um, and one of the guys, his name, his name is Michael. He is an ex from the past. So he is a, uh, he is someone who I went to high school with. And while we were in high school, you know, we went together for a very short time. Okay. It was like a month. <laughs> and Romeo, he was the other guy who was in my dream. Romeo, I also went to high school with him, but Romeo was the ladies man. Okay. That was his nickname, Romeo, but he was the ladies man. He was the playboy, you know, um, he was the one who flirted with women, knew all the right words to say. Okay, so keep this in mind. Okay, so Romeo, he wasn't he wasn't trying to get in my vehicle. He was standing outside the vehicle, just looking at me. And Michael was the one who was in the who who he kept getting in the back seat. And each time he would get in the back seat, he was trying to talk to me. And I kept saying, "Get out." get out. Right. And I was just so over them. <laughs> I was, I just remember being so frustrated and upset and I was just like, get out. I remember saying it one last time and they finally uh, got out of the vehicle where Michael, he finally got out of the vehicle and I slammed the door and then the dream shift to a whole entire different dream. So here's the word of the Lord. Beware of exits from your past coming back. OK, in this hour, exes from your past contacted you. They coming back, you know, um, and this is why they coming back, because they see how you're elevating. OK, and they also going to come back because the devil, you know, he, he there's a blessing up ahead. Your spouse is about to call you. You know, you about to walk into your your God or marriage and the devil know it. And so he's going to send people from your past. OK, way back in the past. Remember, I said this was a boyfriend I, I used to go with in high school, okay? The devil already know he can't seduce me with these children's fathers, okay? He already know where I stand at with them. So he's going to try to go all the way back to people, you know, to someone I dated in high school, okay? And this reminds me because I think it was last week, I had a dream of another guy I dated in high school and I was crazy in love, you know, with this one. And I, and I remember when I woke up, I said, why, why was he in my dream? why I, you know like he's really cray cray he's crazy in the mind um but i remember asking myself why why did i have a dream about him but it's making sense now because god is telling me you know this is what the devil is trying to cook up in the spirit realm and so you know he he sent me here to warn you beware of people from your past popping back up contact you you know telling you everything you want to hear, trying to seduce you, flirting with you. You know, they know how to say all the right words. Okay. Beware of these people. When I typed in, I looked up the definition for Romeo. It says an attractive, passionate male seducer or lover. And this is exactly who Romeo, the one I went to school with, this is how he was, you know, and some of the synonyms for Romeo are ladies, man, womanizer, playboy, player, uh, gigolo, flirt, seducer, lover. Okay. So beware of these individuals, these type of exes, or even just man from man, uh, you might run across their path, you know, and they, they seducing you, they attractive, they flame with you saying all the right words to you. Beware of these individuals. Okay. Because they sit on assignment to distract you and to, um, you know, deter you away from your God ordained spouse. Okay. So, um rebuke this already to start this going to prayer right now begin to rebuke or seducing spear or counterfeit spear people from your past exes from your past trying to come back just go ahead and rebuke it bind it in the name of jesus christ okay take authority over it because that is why i do believe that is why god gave me the dream last week of that one particular ex and then he's giving me that dream today uh and i was very very upset i was yelling i was like get out you know and i was very frustrated with them 
And I knew in the dream, I said, um, in the dream, after I kicked Michael out, I said, I said, these men trying to come back from the past, you know, to talk to me, you know, and I woke up, um, you no, know, the dream shift to, it, it turned into something else, but I remember thinking that in the dream. So that was the Lord just telling me, this is what's, you know, taking place in the spirit realm. Um, and if it come to pass, this is why they coming back. Okay. So that is the word of the Lord. That was my dream God gave me this morning at six, six o'clock this morning. Don't entertain no counterfeit. Don't entertain anyone from the past. You know, they're coming back from the past talking about, oh, uh, you know, how they always felt about you. Don't believe that. Stay focused on your God-ordained spouse. All right. That is it. I am Tequila Coleman. I'll talk to you all real soon. Take care.